Hello, it's Revy here and in today's video I will be showing you guys how to make the thermal camera effect you guys saw in the beginning. And if you guys want to support me I have a website so feel free to check that out. I have some editing pack there that could improve your editing and uh, yeah. Let's get right into this. So the first thing you're going to do is to add a clip you want to use for this uh, effect here. I'm, I'm just going to use a clip here from Sofago's uh, music video, Hell yeah. And you're going to start off by opening up the composition settings. And here we're going to use a VHS resolution, which I already have presetted here. But it's going to look something like this. So the width is going to be 640 and the height is going to be 480. And I'm going to use 15 as frame rate. You're going to press OK. And here, adjust the scale so it fits. And then we're going to add the adjustment layer by pressing Ctrl Alt Y. And here we're going to add Colorama. And this here already looks kind of like a thermal uh, effect here. But we're going to adjust the uh, colors here. So opening up the user preset palette and then choose RGB. And here you're going to start off by setting the red one down here, the blue one on the top. And here at the green we're going to change this one to yellow here. And then we're going to make a color here, it's going to be white. And then here you're going to have a pink purple kind of here. And then here we're going to have a dark purple. Something like that. And then you're going to go to input phase. And here is where you're going to adjust the look. And here you kind of want to drag it to something like this maybe. And yeah, when you're satisfied with your uh, coloring here, you are going to add grid here. And here you're going to set the size from to uh, width and height sliders. And then you're going to set the width to 4000. And the height is going to be 2. And the border should be one. And you're just going to drag this one, this line here, out of the composition. And then here, change it to overlay. And you will get something like this here. I think it looks pretty cool. And you can change the color here to black instead. And then copy the grid to the other adjustment layer if you uh, cut it. And then we're going to add a new adjustment layer again. Control alt y And here, I'm going to be adding a VHS effect preset. I showed you guys in my VHS tutorial, uh, so if you haven't watched that, uh, you know, feel free to check it out. Just to add some a little bit more of contrast here, you guys can just copy the settings here, pause and copy the settings here if you don't have them. Use these settings here, you will get a more realistic look here, and you can mess around with the placement of the layers, so you can maybe drag this one down here, so you get more of the scan lines back. Uh, but then you will get some white things here. So, yeah, you can just, you know, mess around to get a look you like more. And if you're still not, like, satisfied with the, like, look uh, that came out, you can add curves to your clip layer. And here you can uh, drag up and down and adjust how the effect is going to look. Very, very clean. Not gonna lie. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. And uh, if you did, please like and subscribe. And if you guys have any new ideas on tutorials I can make, please comment that down below. And don't forget to check out my website, check out my socials, join my Discord server. And I will see you guys soon. Take care and have a nice day.